Now you've had a chance to practice your OOP skills, let's put them to the test by fixing the bank system. So, what's the problem? Well, the bank system uses an OOP class to represent the books that users can take out. If you think about it, this is a perfect situation to implement abstraction, because books are objects and they have attributes associated with them. If you think about it, when we want to search for a book, we look for the object matching the description. Now the problem is, someone's actually removed the book class, so now no one can take out a book, and the system is actually being overloaded. So we need to fix it. How do we do that? Well, we need to design a new abstraction so that users can still take out books. The problem is, the abstraction has to be just right. If it's too specific, then people won't be able to find their books. Why? Well, if you think about it, when someone's looking for a book, they don't know the number of pages or the color of the book, they know the title and the author. So if your abstraction is too specific, people won't be able to find their books. The same applies if it's too vague, because then there'll be too many books matching the same description. Your skills as an OOP programmer are going to be tested, because you will need to find the correct level of abstraction to replace the book abstraction. Without further ado, let's get started!